when they told you that the dream was over. But here's the truth, your dream is just beginning. The beginning of a new era. This is the XFL. Players from everywhere in the country, all with unique and different backstories, but one dream, to play professional football. Because the X of the XFL represents the intersection of dreams and opportunity. You bring the dreams, we brought the opportunity. Today, there are many who are looking to make those dreams come true. The Arlington Renegades against the Las Vegas Vipers, here in Choctaw Stadium, here in front of the world. XFL, let's ball out, baby! This is the XFL, but many call it the League of Second Chances. For one ex-NFL punter, Marquette King, this is a golden opportunity to make his return to professional football. Marquette King, or is it Marquette? I don't know how I feel right now, man. I gotta see how I feel when I step out. It's a little chilly out here, man, so. There's two of you. There's two. So, obviously we met back in the days. You were playing in the NFL, you were a real one, I gotta say. Cause you reached out to me when I was going through my NCAA situation, bought me a camera, and just kinda told me to stay motivated. That's true, man. Stay motivated, cause. The NFL, what happened, man? What happened? I don't know. Maybe I was, I don't know. I wonder if I was ahead of my time. I wonder if I was just. So you a time traveler? I don't know, maybe I did travel. Maybe I did, man. What do you mean ahead of your time? I don't know. It's, you don't used to see punters dancing and stuff, so I know it was something a little different, but it was just me. I've been doing that my whole life. Do you think dancing with the flag had something to do with it? Not at all, because Travis Kelsey did it. Travis Kelsey is Travis Kelsey. You're Marquette or Marquette King. Hey, that's why we got game day today, cuz. Speaking of game day, I know um, you played in the XFL after you uh, stopped playing in the league, and it seemed like you was having a lot of fun, man. I watched you play a couple times, and then COVID came through and basically shut the league down. How'd that make you feel? Man, I was excited, man, because I was I was looking forward to playing a full, complete season, showing the world what I could do, mm -hmm. and it got to a point to where everything just got shut down, and I was just like, all right, what am I going to do with all my time? So I think it just gave me a chance to start building stuff outside of football that I wanted to build, and just, yeah. Keep been building houses? Um, you got an H people. HGTV show coming or something? No, man, I ain't got that. You <laughs> probably got one. We got a new house coming on the way. Obviously, we're riding to your game day today. The XFL is back. How does that make you feel? I'm excited, man. Dwayne Johnson, Danny Garcia, they're doing what they need to do to give a lot of these players that probably get overlooked or need a second chance. Uh, opportunity to play again in front of people on national television on one of the biggest platforms. And I feel like they're doing a really good job. They got you here, one of the biggest YouTubers in the world. And shoot. Well, thank it's you. Gonna, it's gonna <laughs> it's gonna bring more exposure to the league and a lot of the players to get another a look. Look. A look. A look. It's, it's pronounced look. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> no, I know this is a league of opportunity. Obviously, you're getting a great opportunity. It's your first game. You got eight teams playing in the league, and arguably, you might be playing for the best one. What you going to do with this opportunity, my boy? Man, what I'm going to do with this opportunity, I'm going to just make the best of it. I'm going to have fun. I'm going to play every game like it's my last game. I'm going uh, to enjoy myself, man. It'll be cool if you over there by the kicking that. I'm going to be right. You feel okay. me? Hey, any new dances you cooking up? Man, let me think. We playing the Vipers, right? I gotta think about that. That's like last minute, though. Yeah. <laughs> but nah, no cap, though. I'm excited to watch you ball, my brother. Heck yeah. We watching you do your thing again. Obviously, you know, it's a league opportunity. I feel like I had opportunity as well, but it got cut short and I had to make certain choices. But the fact that this league is back, I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna see how you do today. I'm gonna see how the league go, and I'm gonna see if you feel me, if I wanna I mean, I did ask you if you wanna play, dog. See, like, it's, just, it's just not as easy as just dropping yeah. everything and playing, yeah. you feel me? Yeah. And the fans at home don't really know that, and they always, oh, we gonna play, we gonna play, we gonna play. It's not that easy, but you feel me? We gonna see how the day go by. We gonna see how Cat do. If Cat ball out, then you feel me, I might play for the league. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> Bro, you is silly, dog. You still funny. <laughs> I appreciate you. It's game day here in Arlington. While preparation looks a bit different for everyone, there's one common goal in mind, to put on a show. For players taking the field for the first time, opening day nerves are completely normal. But for the XFL's new ownership, 
pressure of opening day is on another level. Good to see you all again. Good to see you. Good to see you. What are your expectations for this league? Putting this thing together, obviously I'm a big football fan. The XFL happened before. What are you guys doing bigger and better this time? We're doing some stuff with you. <laughs> so that makes it better. That makes it better and cooler. You know what? It's the 2.0 version. The pandemic didn't hit. Yeah. You know, I think we'd have another story. It was doing so well. Spring football has a great thing. Taking care of athletes, giving them more opportunity, yeah. interacting with fans, yeah. bringing this game to life. More of this game. I mean, that's what we're about. We're about opportunities. We're about unleashing the dreams yeah. that football makes possible. Yeah. I mean, you that's get amazing. up every day. That's amazing. And, that's and think about it like this, destroying. This is what happens when people say, oh, no, you can't do that. You know what that's like. You say, no, you can't do that. And you say, actually. Be counted out. Yes. Man, we missed you guys at the ones. We had them in here. No, I was ready. I had my cleats ready to go. I was ready to go. But you got a little DB in your receiver? What? Well, yeah. Very little. <laughs> I don't know if you guys were looking for any kickers that could boot 80 yards, but I got a little something in my in the leg. You got a leg? A little something, a little something. I chose to take the YouTube path, but I still got a little something in me. Let me know if y'all looking for somebody. All right, you can put that on video. Oh, yeah, you feel me? Hey, now it has to happen. It has to happen. It, it has to happen. Excited hey, for the game. We want to acknowledge you, though, too, man. Like all the great work that you're doing, what you've been doing, the model that you've created for these kids and, and big kids out there have been told, like, oh, no, your dream is over. No, it's not. The fact that we get to do things together and work on things together, like you guys helping with the ones, and that's amazing. And we got a lot more to do, bigger and better. You know, 54. Tell me, tell me when you're ready. You let me know, I got the man. cleats. I got you my special know. cleats. I need that workout program too, by the way, man. <laughs> Let's do it. We appreciate you, brother. Keep up the great work. Thank you so much. Thank you. The stage is set. Both teams are looking to start off their season with a victory. In the first half, however. The Vipers were ready to strike first. The Vipers are on the board first. Despite the home field advantage, the pressure is on the Renegades to see how they'll respond. Can somebody tell me in the comments what a renegade is? We've seen dudes on motorcycles riding around. So we figure it's a dude on a motorcycle that be shooting guns and stuff, but let me know in the comments what a renegade is. TV, that boy doing his thing on TV too. Hey, check out the XFL, man. It's on ESPN right now. You like that plug? Car. Hey, Ruff, I got something for you. That was a catch, bro. That was a catch, Ruff. I got a 10 with your name on it. They're reviewing it right now, but look, on one hand, if it's not a catch, we get to watch Cat boot the ball. But if it is a catch, obviously the offense keeps going, but... Oh, catch! Let's go. Hey, that 10 worked now! That 10 worked! Hey, I got more where that came from, you feel me? Oh, Cat out there now. He finna... Look at him. Zoom on. Zoom on zero. Okay? That's what I'm talking about, boy! That's what I'm talking about! Where can that? at? That's all in the league, cuz. Huh? Don't try me, dog. That's all in the league, man. Don't try me, dog. Hey, don't forget the snap, cuz. Huh? You Let's feel me? Baby. The whole entire kick squad gotta get love, man. With both teams going at it defensively, it was time for Marquette King to clock in his first punt of the game. Guess who's coming? Cat, cat, cat. Bro, they were playing cat music. Earlier during warm up, they cut a song on. It was the best punt I ever seen him play. So he about to do his thing, man. He about to do his thing. But the circumstances had other plans. Easy. Let it go, boy. Ah, damn, his first one. Shitty. Ah, cat, come on. Ah, cat, come on. It's all good, man. We we'll bounce back. It's all good. That's Mark Craig. We well, better get the ball, right? With great field placement, the Vipers began to set up another scoring drive. Screen! Screen! Screen. Get off of it, Hulk! Nice job, Hulk. Way to get off of it. Come on. Come on. Damn. D-Hop. That boy D-Hop making side missions, boy. He playing the XFL to stay sharp. Going down 14-3 in the first half, 
the Renegades were all but defeated. Because in the XFL, anything can happen. And with that, the Renegades are back on top. But this is anyone's game, and everyone knows playmakers thrive in the fourth quarter. Get rid of that bit. Oh, snap! Oh! Hey, earlier I was toting, I was cracking on him because he didn't have no wheels. He just proved me wrong. He just proved me wrong. That's him! Aw, oh, damn! Fourth down, money down, ref. Fourth down, money down, ref! We needed that, but it's all good. Defense come out, scrap up, do what y'all gotta do. It's still 5.43 left in the game, fam. Still a lot of ball game left, man. Somebody gonna win. Crazy. What a game. XFL lit, boy. If you don't think it's lit, boy, you sleep. And they got that home. Damn! But the celebration was short-lived, and it was back to business for the Renegades. After several three and outs from both teams, the Vipers will receive the ball with a minute remaining. And for Marquette King, it all comes down to this punt. So I'll come down to Cat. Game winning punt. Just get the ball off, brother. Do your job, get the ball off. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I was nervous because I didn't, I didn't know if, you feel me? I just wanted Kent to get the ball off. That's it. After that, it's out his hands, fam. Do what he had to, man. Do what he had to. But just because they got the punt off doesn't mean they're out of the water just yet. Oh my God, it's coming down to the wire. Hey, you can go for three in this league. You can go for three, so they can win the game. I keep. Hey, they called it. Twenty twenty two, eight seconds left, fam. What y'all finna do? Do the damn thing. Big time play. Big time play! Big time play! And it was that sack that signaled a hard fought home victory for the Arlington Renegades. A victory so sweet that even I had to suit up. Oh, game day! Game day! Wait, where is everybody at? Because the game was yesterday. So I missed it? Yeah. So I'm putting this on for nothing? Yeah, I gotta keep it trendy on my soul. I'm the most selfish person that I know. Here we go down the rabbit hole. Got a couple.